Yeah, it was a good day. I mean, ultimately we're still in preparation mode, so um, we've been really lucky over the last week to play Yorkshire twice in a two-day game, and now in the, the T20 competition. Uh, unfortunately, we came up the wrong end of it today. We got ourselves in a good position in the field and couldn't get over the line with the bat, but uh, overall, the, the the two matches we've had, UAE and Yorkshire, will be great preparation for us going into the season. Well, both sides, um, after the first 10 overs, got shut down a bit. We saw that with Yorkshire and the same thing happened to us. So, you know, you're always trying to improve, get better, and you're always certainly trying to win games, particularly against Yorkshire. But uh, today it didn't happen. They play well. Um, we'll have to just move on. Uh, well, actually, I think we've seen some decent individual performances. Um, I thought George Edwards was really fantastic in both games. Uh, Jarvis also has done well. The spinners we know have got a good calibre and, and bowled well as a unit. Um, but even Reese coming in there at the top of the order in the second game um, did himself a lot of good. Um, you know, this, this still is a pretty young developing T20 side, so considering we're current champions, and, you know, I still think we've got a lot of headroom and a lot of, you know, a lot of scope for development. Yeah, we have. Um, you know, a lot's been made of a uh, second overseas player this year or a T20 overseas player. We might still go that route, but we've seen here we've got a lot of young quality and by the guys who, who want opportunities so ultimately it's up to them they've got to take those opportunities but uh, you know that's that's sort of always something we'll look at heading into the t20 campaign in the summer